All right, here's a match two, pretty similar. Looks like everybody's in the game this time for uh, each of these teams. Uh, first shot at playing on Ark here, which has the new rollout of 3.0 Tag Pro. Buckyball's gonna, they're gonna pick up two, three power ups, and they are both two dishes for the offenders on Captain Planet. They do get a Tag Pro, which is pretty big game. And holy shit, that flag is ginormous. <laughs> uh, that must be an interesting thing with the user with modding the size right here. <laughs> this is absolutely the funniest fucking thing I've seen in a while. Um, Kevin make a nice job getting out there on Bali and Butter. Can't quite go the distance, but it's a nice little split. Let's see if Trippy can make something happen here. Being nice and patient. Probably not going to get out, so we're wisely not making the grab. Until being forced to. Ibis makes a great job grabbing and kissing the other flag carrier. Looks like teams are recognizing their power up woes from the uh, first half here. And try and get an advantage. Uh, Trippy gets the middle one. Nakova defuses the rolling bomb on the other team, and Swerg picks up a tag pro. For defense, uh, this is a pretty good opportunity here. He needs to pop Buckyball, give Trippy just a walk in here. And oh, just Bucky just made that so clutch, and now he's gonna get away. And so that's pretty harsh. So we can't quite make the snipe go where he wants it to go. And uh, Bucky's free all the way to base. But Nakova's got plenty of space and not getting popped, so they're not giving up a cap here. Swear so goes and hunts down Buckyball. Apparently pissed off how much he missed that snipe. <laughs> Just going straight at him. And Bucky makes a great snipe on the Koba. Trippy swings right past Bali. Swerg staying back on Ree while Ibis is being aggressive to go after. Swerg picks up the flag. Bali doing a good job of just staying alive against Ibis here. And gets the cab. Wow, better turn with a nice return. And uh, Bali, good job staying heads up. Just keep himself uh, in in scoring position. And Monty's away with a rolling bomb, so Ibis really needs to be careful here. Maybe give himself some space. And just doesn't happen. Uh, luckily, Trippy and Nakoba keep Monty from scoring even with a rolling bomb. And Butter Trink is to return. They're going to need to get a grab and get away. And Nakoba gets returned. This is looking... Pretty poor and should be an easy cap for Monty Ball, and it is. Captain Planet uh, doing doing some pretty nice moves here. Trippy's gonna get away. Ibis got that button for him uh, quite skillfully. Picky Ball patient and winning his boost. It's a little block from Bali. Which he needed to keep his advantage. Swerge got a rolling bomb. He's done a good job of staying on top of power ups. Koba's going to pick up their juke juice. Uh, Monty has a uh, tag pro, but they're just trying to get a reset here. He's going to enable to get Bali out. Swerge doing a good job of staying alive. See if Butter can snipe him. And he can. Oh, it was fortunately just the timing and the tag pro lead. This thing is not going the T-Rex way today. And Red's operating quite like the way they want to operate all the time. Good job, Ibis, dominating that button on Monty. It's not something I'd expect Monty to be able to take away from Ibis ever. Like good overall performance just from every ball right now for the uh, Captain Planet team. Blue's playing well as well, just uh, not quite in the right place at the right time. Nice little uh, snipe block from Trippy there. But Butter Turn is going to pick up a Tag Pro. And Koba needs to be able to get this in and oh, makes another try at that snipe block. And it didn't quite work out for him. So hopefully they can. Oh, Trippy's. Didn't go one. Grants. Might could have got away with it. I think when you're down by six caps, you've got to go for the risky plays. But that's just my opinion. 
definitely not your uh, standard or or probably most of the time the correct decision. <laughs> uh, but I'm a fan of risky strats. Uh, if it's got to go and shut, got to shut Bucky down. If he gets the chance to get out, there goes your scoring opportunity. And with uh, 4 minutes 50 seconds to play, you've got to be pretty aggressive on blue. It may lead to a bigger blowout, but it doesn't really matter. It's just the win or loss that matters. Kova gets a nice little trick there on uh, on Bali Lama. Evis gets a return. Kova waiting on that power up. Explains why he was. Oh, and Pucky Paul is done with this junk. Shuts him down on the gate. Uh, Monty's going to try and sneak in. Can't do it. Sword gets there ahead. I got that tag pro runs out, unfortunately. Ibis not going to make it. Nico grabs just out of position. And this ought to be a cap pretty easy for Bucky. Yeah. Kova makes a nice little sniper turn. And does get the reset for his team, which was pretty crucial. They're going to have to haul balls to... Uh, Get eight caps to get a win right now. Seven to seven to force in overtime. And uh, Ibis Monty can't just sneak out like that on Sorgan Ibis, but they do shut him down halfway. Uh, Bucky's gonna come with that pup, and Ibis knows it, goes and shuts him down. Pretty good redemption there for that for allowing that escape. Bucky gets a nice grab. He's on the jig juice to. Enable this bounce and just slides out. Monty setting up a nice little block. Bucky reading it well. Backing out. All four in base. Nakoba wisely being aggressive and trying to get out of there. Doesn't happen, but Ibis is going to be able to get out, it looks like. As long as Butter can't catch up to him. Bumping into corners, though. Makes a nice little juke, though, to make up for it. Bucky is going to pick up that tag for a middle, though. And Trippy's going to watch out because Bucky's going to pop him. And he does, leaving them without a regrab. So Ibis needs to stay alive. Jacoba does get the return. Ibis going around top. That may not be too hot for him. Oh, and Jukes the shit out of Bucky. That was a great move from Ibis. Gets him and gets the pop. A butter's coming for him with a rolling bomb. Kiss is a great choice there for Bali. They've got a big lead and there's no need to give it up. Monty bumps Butter right out of the way from getting popped. Nice little surprise work. Koba's in base, but there's no way he's going to get that return. And Bucky's going to sneak out too again. Koba trying to get back on re. Everyone needs to just hustle to defense here. And they get there just in time to prevent a cap. Oh, Bucky snakes right through Swerg and Ibis. And I'm surprised that I can actually call him Ibis. <laughs> Swerg's going to get popped and they're going to get another cap dropped on top. The defense of, uh, of Bali and Butterturn has been really impressive this game. Both, both halves. Their ability to get those double returns and uh, for Monty and Bucky to sneak out has definitely enabled them. Oh, and then Bucky just pops too. Easy scrab ever for Monty. Uh, Ibis grabbing with that tag pro and them coming in is probably not what he wanted to do, but he stays alive long enough to help his team get back. And he sneaks out of base. Pretty good work. Goes for the kiss. Cub has got to hope to make this hit. It doesn't. And Bucky's going to get free through the middle. Sword trying to make something happen. Can't quite get there. Just too much defense there. And again, uh, Captain Planet's trying to figure out what way to go. And Akua makes a good patient choice. Boosts right through the middle. Gets to base. Butter's there with a rolling bomb. And he's going to get popped on the gate. 
I'm gonna pick up a rolling bomb. Sorg got him trapped. And they can't quite count on that gate. But Sorg's gonna have to go ahead and try and shut it down. Can't do it. And they finally get him up. Three, two, See if Ibis and Sorg can shut down Monty Ball. It's just far too late. And Kevin Planet's your winner this round. Good game to both teams. But uh, Captain Planet definitely won it.